four. Yeah, I got bomb over here. East, west, west, west. Last guy's west. Last time expired in ten seconds. Got him. Sit down, boy. Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Dirty Dave. In this video, we're going to be defending CCTV and Cash Room. So, I'm going to give this objective second place after Church and Arsenal being first place. Before the Clubhouse map buff, it used to be Barn Stock. But with the map buff, I'm going to give CCTV and Cash the edge, mainly because defending Stock Room is like defending kids' bedroom when all the walls are reinforced. And we all know how that's a meme. So, going with our team composition. We're going to be taking Mira and Bandit every single time. Now for our third, fourth, and fifth pick, there's a lot of options to choose from. Jaeger solid for every objective. Smoke is solid for every objective. You can go mute dep depending which set of reinforcements you're going to want to use, and I'll definitely mention that when it comes to that. And then Legion, he's great for stairs, and there's a lot of stairs around objective, so he's solid for that. And then anywhere the attackers can plant, they can be C4 from below, so that's when Pulse and the Valkyrie come in, and there's plenty of great Valcams I'm going to show you guys that can watch outside. And then your solid Roamers, Vigil, Ella, and Alibi, I would only take one of them at the most. And then for our passive anchors, Maestro and Echo, um, I don't recommend them from here just because the objectives are really small, and when it comes to small objectives, there's no place for them to hide. So, yeah. Going Alibi for Destruction, and let's get right to it. So, going over the basics real quick, most of the attackers are going to try to plant over in CCTV around the server block. So, right here. So, they're going to try to plant here, mainly because the walls, there's two entrances from the outside. So, you have that one, and then this window. Versus cash room, there's no entrances from the outside. So over here in workshop or construction and then the stairs on the other side of that wall. So obviously the hot zone is CCTV. Now going with our wall, so I'm going to mention reinforcements and destruction. Let's go with the destruction first though. So we're going to obviously open up the walls between the objectives. So if you have impacts, I'll double impact this wall or just make a line of sight at least. But since we got this B shotgun, we're going to destroy it completely. So, okay. Oh, I missed. Rip. Right here. All right, then we're going to make a line of sight on this wall. Rotation on that wall and then open up this hatch here in construction. So this hatch drops into stage So this is the bar area So right there, so this is our destruction rotation from stairs and Then right here, we're gonna put a mirror on this wall and let's just have a good line of sight Down there so right there and then obviously opening the wall between objectives So we have that our destruction and the next up wall So there's five essential walls that we want to get every time so this will be one two right here three four and five so this is an outside wall and then with this room you can't really defend it because of that hatch so you definitely need to reinforce these walls so next five if you want to defend garage you can definitely do it with your next four reinforcements six seven eight and nine and with your tenth reinforcement it goes to your mirror wall which is right here in the middle. So then your second mirror will be on this, facing into the CCTV, but that's that. Next up are other set of reinforcements. So you can, if you're not gonna defend garage, obviously reinforce it, so that'd be six and seven. Remember, we're keeping our essential five. So six, seven, this is gonna be eight right here, and we're gonna put a mirror on this reinforcement. This is gonna be nine with our primary mirror. And then with 10, um, doesn't really matter but the next best thing is either like right here because we cannot defend this room from the hatch or right here do reinforce this wall so you have some cover when you're trying to come over here and rotate and you just don't get shot when you're trying to rotate so that's our reinforcements next up barbed wire so you at least want four and then at the most you want six so we're gonna double up these stairs at the very minimum so one and two then we're going to do three and four and then five and six. If you have those, I put five right there. 
and then six either at this window or on those stairs so that's our barbed wire next up some angles I really want to show you guys this dope angle it's not uh, it's more useful for the roamers if, instead of the anchors but this is just something dope if you're defending barn stock this is really useful if you can get it on so you're just gonna want to run from the left side and just kinda run up this uh, machine I think it's a coffee maker right there okay so right here we have some good angles, so right there, uh, I don't know what that area is called, but it's kind of like a little lobby, and then right there, that's stock. But this is just a great angle when people are just... This is a high traffic area, especially coming from the outside. That's just a dirty angle that I really like. And then right here, so if you lay down the stairs, you can actually see the window, and you can actually shoot through this crack. You probably want to be able to see the pellets, but... So we're shooting through the window and see if we can find the pellets. Right there is, yep, you can see them right there. So you can definitely shoot through that little crack and then catch the people. So that's nice. And then from here with this mirror opened up, we can just open up this wall. You can see the people hopping all the way into the master bedroom window. When you have this mirror, just have these angles. And over here in the construction window, just lots of good angles. You can open this up. And then, yeah, that's about it. Oh, for vertical, for vertical angles, so right here, this is a good angles onto the stairs. So right there, they try to come up the stairs, that's solid. And then backwards right here, so this is the garage door down below, so that's solid. And then over here in stock, that's actually right here. So right there, this is the stock door, you can actually get a little bit part of their back right there then over here is a little kind of cross-section area so from the leads from the outside door right there a little coming in from bar so yeah that's our angles right there and I think it's time to go to our defenders all right going to our mirror stuff now this is gonna be our primary mirror window that you're gonna want to use every single time so right here you just watch cash room from here you have this rotation into the objective and then with this mirror window you can see if they hop into the construction window and if they hop into the master bedroom window right there so that's solid and then right here you just you still have the little tiny angle that I showed you guys right there and then you can do work from the stairs onto that door catch some heads so with the second mirror window right here take a look always destroy around your mirror so you have better view so this is depending which reinforcement you use this this can be your second mirror window so right here you can watch that wall and and the window at the same time so the reason why you reinforce this wall versus this wall is that from here you're vulnerable from the window on this wall you're vulnerable from the outside wall right there so I'd rather be vulnerable from a window than a wall so we got that and then like I said always destroy around your mirror so you have a wider field of view and if you defend a garage then this is where I would put the mirror which is right here you can watch both the window and the wall so right here you don't have enough reinforcements for it but put it at crouch height and you're solid so that's it for our mirror alright so onto our Valkyrie cams I have a couple to show you guys so I have three solid outside Valkyrie cams and then I have a couple inside so it's gonna take two rounds to show you guys but right here if you get to throw a camera outside to watch south side this is the one you're gonna want to use so we're gonna aim for that lamp but instead we're gonna aim high and you're gonna want to aim higher or just at the top of that top window so right there a little bit more to the left Let's see if we get it right there perfect spot on so with this you have a great view of the garage side of the windows just great solid cam you can see them if they're on the roof so that's that cam so this next cam is if you want to be cheesy and just kind of more of a run out cam than anything but you can get some good intel with it so right here we're going to need to open up this wall and you're going to kind of make it crowd size I kind of messed up blowing up this part but what we're going to do is we're going to run out of here throw it on top of that ventilation I kind of messed that up a little but right here this is just so we have a good cam on the roof and then a good cam outside so with this 
If they spawn over in the northeast behind that little building behind the tree, you could run out on them. So you watch the cam, they come out, bam, 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 bam. And then right here, it's not that noticeable. To be honest, I kind of messed up with that hitting that. I went a little bit too high. But right there, the, yeah, I went a little bit too high. But that's like one shotgun shot too high. So right there, they don't really want to notice it. So right there. So that's pretty solid. You kind of want to aim from over here. I went a little bit right on the corner. It's actually kind of perfect, but it's more noticeable. So you definitely want to aim for that cam. And then the final one that's outside is over here in stock. So quite a ways. So realistically, you won't be able to get all these cams because they're all outside and you don't have that freaking... I guess luxury of to do it because you'll get shot. But right here, these are probably like the three best outside of cams you can get. So I definitely really like this one. This one's probably the most useful, and yeah, that's our outside cams. All right, going with our inside of cams. If we're gonna throw one for the objectives, I'll throw it over here in this corner so you can watch both bombs right here. So you can watch both bomb sites pretty well this Valkyrie camera so that's what I recommend for the objective cam and then over here in garage if you want to throw one in garage I'll throw it right there on that fence so right here you can see all the garage and you can see through the fence and they come through the walls to the left so that's pretty solid and then for the third one I don't really have any anything special other than just watch some like high traffic areas so you can definitely throw one in uh right here in bar so I would throw it like right there so you can see both sides of the wall so that's pretty solid and then if you just want to throw one over on the west side of second floor you can throw one in construction so you can throw in construction on here on this light right there if you want to watch construction or if you want to watch a bedroom honestly people are not going to be looking for cams so you can just pop one in the corner right there so yeah that's that would be our cams inside of cams I really like the outside of cans but realistically you're not gonna be able to pull them all off so right there that's our cams alright on to our other operators that's gonna be our bandit Jaeger smoke lesion uh, mu and yeah I think that's about it maybe your roamers yeah your alibi vigil Ella okay so going with uh, smoke because he's uh, probably one of the more crucial ones he's just gonna be playing your second mirror so you, you have your primary mirror right here and then your secondary mirror either on that wall or this wall smoke is just gonna play the secondary mirror window and then bandit he's gonna use his three bandits on this wall and you can't really bandit trick because of this window but these are just important walls to get and if you can we try to bandit trick this wall because this is an outside wall right here you can see the brightness so then if you have a mute as well I'll definitely mute the garage walls so you can mute that that and then you can mute that important wall that I mentioned right there actually mute right here and then mute the stairs so you're gonna want bandit every time so right here this is a key wall as well so this is something mute can do and mute is definitely useful so that's mute and then uh, Jaeger, obviously you just put him with your anchor, so whoever's on the mirrors. And then I'll probably put one over here in construction. So on the mirrors, and then one in construction, like right there. So that's Jaeger, then he can go roam. Roamers, they can go down below. And if they're like a Pulsar Valkyrie, you can see for anywhere underneath. And if you're roaming, probably defend the west side over here. Um, who else did I mention? Legion. He's probably going to be our final guy. There's plenty of stairs so right here. These are popular stairs. Just like uh, think of it on Oregon when you're defending dorms. So the second floor objective, usually you have the white stairs and someone's chilling up there. So when they hit the lesion, Mira can hear them hit the lesion and come down and just destroy them. And then you have the garage stairs over there. And then you have the bar stairs, I guess. Um, let's see what the callouts for them. I would say uh, they're not necessarily... I guess it's the closest thing to main stairs, but not for objective. So central stairs, uh, yeah, I'll probably say bar stairs. Yeah. So, yeah, I think that's it for other operators. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like. And if you want more Dare Dave, please subscribe. Till then, see you guys next time.